Hey, ladies and gentlemen, uh, thank you for joining. Um, if you're here, if you run across this video, it's probably because you want to get rid of some malware on your computer. Um, I don't know if this works for all malware, but the specific one I'm going to talk about is one called, it, it says Search Mine. Um, basically what it is, it's a browser hijacker. So if your browser has been hijacked on a MacBook, um, I'm going to help you do it. So this one is my MacBook Pro with all the bells and whistles. Um, I use this for trading and I use a Windows terminal on my MacBook and receive the message to up grade or uh, something to do with flash I clicked that button and all hell broke loose um, a lot of pop-ups and different ads and all kinds of stuff and the major thing that happened was my browser got hijacked so I use Chrome I like using Chrome I'm gonna open Chrome right now and I've I've done some different things um, just looking online if you search like see for instance this is not my search engine this is about search mine here and if you click it it'll some some little guy in freaking tel aviv israel that i'd like to meet one day face to face that has created this crap but anyway um it pretty much has hijacked my search engine if i open up a new tab it's always going to open up not google but this search mine crap. So <clears throat> how you would normally go about, you know, changing back your browser is the three buttons up here, going to settings. From settings, you scroll down and you, you change it. I want to show you something first, though, before I scroll down. If your browser has this message where your browser is managed by your organization, and this is a solo computer for you, you can best believe your browser has been hijacked, okay? Um, if you scroll down to where your search engine is, um, you'll see manage search engines. Uh, if you click it, you're gonna see all this garbage. Uh, search mine, duck, duck, go, I mean, all this crap that, that I don't use. Uh, interestingly enough, when you first download this, what happens is, or when you first get infected, um, you won't get a where you can remove this from the list. It'll be default and you cannot change it. But whatever they've written in their code um, has it to where you, it doesn't matter what you do, you can't change your browser settings. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to remove this from the list. I'm going to remove all of these from the list. Uh, even the Yahoo one. So I don't really particularly like Yahoo. I do like my Google browser. Um, I'm going to remove all those. I'm going to close Chrome. And what I'm going to do is not just close out the tabs, but I'm going to hit Command, Option, Escape. And I'm simply going to force quit. All right. When I force quit, the next thing I'm going to do um, some of you will have this option, some of you won't. You're going to go to um, the Apple logo. Uh, you're going to click the preference pane. And right here, you should have profiles uh, icon. As you see, mine is missing. <laughs> so in the, pro the, the, and then what I'll do is, let me see if I've got it. I've got the steps here, and I'll put it a link in the de description um, exactly what you need to do. But you would just select uh, all the admin press profile and delete them, okay? And it tells you how to do that. Uh, once you've done that, you're going to open a terminal app and go to work. And I'll show you. So I'll leave this open so we can copy and paste um, some of these commands in the terminal um, in the terminal pane. So what I'm going to do is I'm, I'm simply going to uh, <clears throat> click command space, type in terminal. 
which you see terminal comes up and I'm going to type in specific commands okay so I'm gonna I'm gonna have it in the uh, bottom down there uh, in the description so that you can type it in and go from there defaults write com google dot chrome home page is new tab page very important that you type this exactly like it is here and after every command you're gonna hit enter okay that's the first one defaults right com google chrome c h r o m e new tab page location Like I said, this is going to be in the description down there. Um, and I screwed up. Let's see where I put that. I'm actually going to rewrite this again. So it was supposed to be this one. And you can actually copy and paste. I was trying to type it out, but I'm just gonna copy, go back to the terminal, paste, enter. Whoops. Okay, now it's telling me command not found. Hmm. I'm sorry, yo. Been a long day. But basically, it's going to be in the description. You're going to put all these into your your pain and do that so once you're done with that close it out close out terminal um, you can command um, and close out all this stuff I would once you have it closed out you should be able to open Chrome Open a new page, new page, new page. Voila, that search me crap is gone. So again, you, you may see the command not found, but that certainly will get rid of that garbage, uh, that search me garbage on your uh, browser. So this worked in Chrome. So again, I'm going to put this in the direct. I'm sorry, the direction. I'm going to put this in the bottom uh, description, uh, what you need to type out. Again, I'm going I'm to print all the directions, as you see down there at the bottom, um, and it should take care of that hijacked browser. So I'm going to close Chrome again and just go back to it just to make sure um, that we're good. So, yeah, you see at the bottom there, this is, this is Google Chrome. So I had actually paused my session and logged out because uh, this thing is actually malicious. And I'll log in again in a minute. But um, they can get your information and, and all kinds of crazy stuff. So uh, it's something to definitely be 
uh, alert to. Uh, but as you see the search in here, the default browser is boom. See that? And then uh, if you click on manage search engines, uh, you don't see that duck, duck, go and search mine and all that crap there. So we're good. So now if I close this out, and I'm actually going to close out Chrome again, command, option, escape. I'm going to force quit. Now I'm going to open up Chrome again, and boom, every new tab that I open now is Google Chrome. I just got rid of the search mine malware. Now I'll tell you also, just, uh, just so you know, uh, I also use malware bytes, um, and I ran it, and it, it says it's clean. Watch, I'll do it right now. It, it, it takes maybe a minute or so. Um, if you care to look at it, uh, run it and do its thing. This is a good uh, malware remover. Um, I have not upgraded the premium. It's worked just fine for me on all of my MacBooks. I've got four total MacBooks that I use for trading and for different applications. And uh, malware bytes works really well. Um, but it will not remove that search mine malware for some reason so again use the description down below and if it works for you great i'm glad that this video could help you to remove that crap that search me browser hijacker again don't worry about the if you don't have the profiles tab in the preferences pane don't worry about that uh, just do what i did you're going to hit command spacebar uh, which was it will pull up uh, the search, the spotlight search, and then just type in terminal. Okay, so again, you type in terminal and then you just click on terminal, open it up, and then begin to, uh, I guess you can copy and paste um, your commands in there, all those commands. After every command, hit enter. When you're done, close it out. Make sure you do this with Google Chrome closed. And... Uh, that should be a fix. Again, thanks for watching. Hopefully that helps.